Voters in Clay County may get another chance to vote for justice of the peace, depending on what the Republican Party there is advised to do uh, about what happened in that race. One candidate was disqualified because he's not registered to vote as required by election law. Michael Russell came in third place with 19% behind Lanny Evans and incumbent John Swenson. Officials say they did not find out Russell wasn't registered until he tried to vote. But County Judge Mike Campbell says under election law, when a candidate is ruled ineligible, the candidates in the runoff are determined in the regular manner without regard to the votes received by the ineligible candidate. To make it simple, under this ruling, it appears Lanny Evans is the winner. But the question is, should the second place candidate, Swenson, be entitled to a runoff when the actual votes, uh, votes cast did not give any candidate a majority? That's a question for the Secretary of State's office and the Republican Party, as well as who will pay for the election, the party or a candidate. We're going to bring you the latest, so stay tuned. Okay, let's